think the feedback will be probably the middle of the year from that point of view. I don't think there's any rush. He, well, he was an exceptional two-year-old himself and he was probably the first manager to win over a mile. So I don't think they won't run it to, but listen, I think the feedback we got from the trainers and the people who broke the horses. He was such a lovely horse. That he's something, he's really exciting for us all. And look, he's with the right people, and so we're very hopeful. Yeah, very excited about him. I always look forward to the, to the first uh, crop of runners by SR. Sometimes with trepidation, sometimes with confidence, and it's with confidence this year, I think. Big fan of this horse, and um, there's a lot of qualities he's looking for in a, in a potential stallion. He's by Johannesburg, which adds that little bit of uh, magic and mystery to it, because he's such a good star of stars with uh, Sageburg, who I think is very good, and uh, obviously uh, Scat Daddy. Yeah. Uh, he's a very good, tough racehorse, and he's very sharp early two-year-old. He won twice in April as a two-year-old of a five furlong, something that a lot of people forget. Um, he's a beautiful stock, he's gone, all, he's gone to all the top trainers, and I'm starting to get very good reports from people only this week. I never really ask, but I let the sort of information feed back to me. I know Midland Park are very excited about a coach with Richard Hannon, and I've got some breeze of people, and they're normally the first to tell you, uh, and they're starting to tell me very, very positive stuff, so I'm starting to get a little bit uh, excited about it. Italian champion, this is worth it. Yeah, well we were the first to find a, a, a son of Dubawi for Ireland. Um, he's now been joined by Knight of Thunder and obviously uh, New Bay down in, in Bally Lynch. But Dubawi's going from strength to strength. Worth Ad was a hell of a racehorse. Um, you know, we pointed out the fact that you know, the Italian Guineas Derby double maybe was higher in prestige once upon a time, but still a hell of a performance for any racehorse to win two high high profile races like that in, in a short space of time over completely different trips. You know, he was a good racehorse. Mark Prescott had him and was second in the lock in ran a really good race. Proper group one horse. He, in fact, he's one of the highest rated horses we've ever stood with, with a rating in, in the mid 20s. You know, so this is a serious racehorse. He's from the White Star Line family. I love his pedigree. Like every stallion on the page is, is, a, is a top class stallion. Every mare on his page is a top class brood mare. There's an awful lot of class in his package. He hasn't been particularly well supported, which means the odds are stacked against him. But I wouldn't be at all surprised if he comes up with some seriously good horses. He won't win the Sire's table, you know, but I bet you he'll get race horses. Yeah, well, the interesting thing about Epaulette is how well the market received him, which is, you know, which is, a, you know, they're better judges than me. Um, his yearling sold extremely well. Um, you know, he came in at a fee of seven thousand euros. They averaged forty, and um, top price of one fifty. And um, so he was very well supported. And um, you just saw him there. You know, very nice horse, good, powerful two-year-old. Um, he is, of course, a brother to Helmet, who's done exceptionally well with his first crop two-year-olds. But Epaulette looks more a two-year-old type horse. You know, so. High expectations, yeah. and uh, let's hope we live up to them. I'm, I'm personally very excited to see the, the first of the Don approach two-year-olds hit the track. He's my favourite horse in the yard, and um, you know, and it's easy to forget just what a race horse he was. To get out and win his maiden in March, win a Coventry, you know, he was a real precocious early two-year-old. But to, to carry that through to the end of the year, win a Dewhurst, come back and win a Classic, it's, it's a very rare thing. Um, and he did it all, so of, of his two-year-olds can be half as good as he was, we'll be in great shape. <laughs>